Yeah. So I know we've talked a little bit of a couple of different um, options local to you, uh, but what are the what are the signs that really indicate that an organization or a community is going to be good for for networking? Hmm. Well, to certain to a certain extent, it's trial and error. Um, I just hired a woman in our Arizona office and she is a salesperson for us. And I had her list out like 50 different associations or events. And she started going to some of them and she started a- after going to them, she started to learn from, from folks she talked to, like what were the big pillars of the community? Right. And I don't know, I don't remember the names, but she identified like three that were the big ones that everybody was a part of. So, but also, you know, you might find like maybe you're, um, let's say you're a, a recent grad and you, you get a job at Paychex, right? They spend a lot of time calling on like, you know, CPAs and you can get involved in a CPA association, right? Just try out a couple and see which ones work for you. Cool. So really, I mean, just balancing trial and error to see where you can show up as your most authentic self and get aligned with the cause that they're working towards. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then when you're there, right, you say like, Hey, I'm a young professional and, um, you know, I'm trying to make the most of my career here. Like do you have any tips for me? Mm-hmm. And it goes a long way because professionals love to give advice and asking for it is a great opener. Mm-hmm.